my name is Ishan and I'm the e-commerce consultant for Evactus and in this video we are going to see how to manage categories and subcategories in your Evactus storefront so you need to sign into your admin front first and once you're there just go to catalog and click on manage categories and in manage categories option there you can see all the categories which are already created so if you want to create a category you select the home and right click there and you can create a child subcategory so this is the new category which will be created so I'm going to name it as artwork and now I can drag and drop this category anywhere so let's say since this is a category I place it under the home and click on save changes and if I click on storefront I can see this category has been created now if I need to create a subcategory within this category I again select this category right click and then again create a child subcategory and I'm going to name it as paintings and then I can add one more subcategory in artwork by simply selecting paintings and creating a category after so if you want to create a category before you can create category before by clicking on this option I'm creating category after so I click on this and enter the new subcategory as modern art and to create a category before sculpture as another category so we have three categories now three subcategories now and to create more categories within these I can simply create another child subcategory let's say as Christmas paintings and then I save changes now let me go to my storefront I click on the original artwork category which I created paintings sculpture modern art now it has another subcategory as Christmas paintings now if I need to edit this Christmas paintings subcategory I can simply select it it's selected already then go to edit button and depending on my business requirements I can change the category status from online to offline and if I click on save before that I can also set a larger image for the category and a smaller image set the image description and for SEO purposes I can enter page title meta keywords meta description and SEO URL prefix and then after I filled all the information I can click on save and now the category status is offline right now so if I just go to storefront it's not visible there so 
if I again go to modern art click on edit and there is another option which says show products only from this category so if I need to show products only from this category I can keep this option checked or if I want to show products on from all subcategories I can check this option and then click on save depending on again my requirements now I can again change its status to online by clicking on edit button change the status to online save go to my storefront and it's back again there so it's as simple as that i hope you really enjoyed this video and if you have any queries you can just contact us at support at thank you